podcast habla un artista. On this episode, the artist Alabi Abdul Rashid Olawali from Osogbo, Nigeria. Hi, on this new episode of Habla un Artista, we are with the artist and painter, Mr. Alabi, he is in Nigeria. Alabi, good day. Thank you so much for being in this space with us. How are you? Yeah, I'm fine. Um, good day. I'm a little bit up by this. If you don't mind. Um, no, no, no. Don't yeah. worry. Don't worry. <laughs> You know, this space is for you to, to share your experience, how you become an artist, and why do you love painting? Okay. Um, I, I love uh, it. So, when, when did you start painting? When, when did you first um, find out that you love to paint and start doing such great artwork? Um, oh, thank you very much. Um, this is yes, on my journey as a leader. So uh, I started around, I think, around 2018, 2019, and I've been an artist, like a, a kid that have passion in making art. So I started to put more focus and more attention in making art, and I want to see myself as a kid. Oh, wow. So you start really young, and you seem very young <laughs> still. Yeah. <laughs> That's good. And and when you start painting, do you start like a, do you do it professionally? You went to school to start um you know uh, as a professional, is, or is just uh, self taught? How has been that process with you? Um, actually, um, there's one thing about her. You know, you can't be teach on how to do. That's it. You know, I just like the talent. So you think you have, and you have to work on it. So I can say I'm a self taught artist. So I have um, many mentors uh, guiding me, um, guidance, mentors, artists that I look up to. Um, so, and they all shaping my career. And I give thanks to God. Great. That's that's very interesting. And and what is your me and, um, what is the mentor that you have, or what is your favorite artist that has influenced your painting style? So um, one of my mentor artists is Anisi uh, Stanley. He's a Nigerian artist also. Uh, um, he's very contemporary and he's an um, hyperrealistic. Uh, he makes realism, hyperrealistic drawings. So and I learn from him mostly. So I'm um, from different artists. So I love the guy. He, he makes beautiful drawings with the use of pencil. Um, yeah. So, well, that's that's so good. Yeah. Uh, and and that's very very interesting. How you know you can incorporate some of the styles from these artists or these other artists? Because w when I was uh, checking some of your um, paintings. It was very interesting how realistic you made them uh, on the, you know, some of the faces, the, the expression on the eyes. It's very, very high quality. Um, yes, um, actually, with the help of, like, like I said, like I said, and with the help of other artists I look out, I watch their videos online, and then most, especially, I have the boss. So he has been there for me for some years ago, and he's no longer with me. So and since then, I've, I've, I've been boss on my own. So I watched I, I watch their drawings and decided to bring up myself with the use of pencils, paints, my colors like um, my color, I tell you, um, my emotions, gloss, to make beautiful work of art. So I think that is interesting. I'm a most new artist in my family, so I don't have any, 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 any more doing that. So I can say I'm the first artist in my family. So oh, wow. That, so congratulations, then. <laughs> because if you're the first uh, artist, it's it's very uh, fulfilling, I believe. Thank you very much. Uh, I'm really happy to see you. 
Uh, and then how is the support of your family for being an, a painter? Because uh, sometimes, you know, the, the help of the family and support, it, it, it helps a lot for an artist to grow. Um, actually, um, my, my family has been supportive since I was a kid. Um, and to see where I then, when I love drawing, um, especially my dad. So it was the one that he gave me full support. He gave me full support. He actually gave me full support that um, I should fix my, uh, what I love to do. And I decided to pick it as a career. So he has been there for me. And my, 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 my family has been there for me. And we in and out. And everything that matters me, my career. That's that's fantastic, and you know that's very blessed. But you know, a, a lot of blessing being uh, supported by by family. And when you start painting, how is that process? That creativity process. Do you take pictures and then start painting on everything? It's on your mind that you start like uh, putting on on the canvas. How is that um, first steps before applying some color to the painting? So actually, like I said, um, a data and I also make pencil drawing, something like this. Yeah. So it, it, it's a gradual process. So before, yeah, before making something like this, uh, I tend to work, tend to work like this. Uh -huh. So I started with pencils like HD, 2D, 10D, and, and so on and so forth. So, and because each pencil has its own, its own, its own, its own work in making drawings. So, and, and as for painting, um, I use my then, I use, I use oil color. As a professional artist, I use oil color. So, to make my things, my paintings, and I have a lot of my paintings outside. So, some of them are not here. So, I have it outside, and I have some in the gallery. Oh. But that well, that's that's very 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 nice. And and how long once you have the idea, how long it will take for you to finish a, a painting? You know how long it takes you. Um, on how big the picture is on, and as an artist, I always want to do. I always want to get out of my work. So sometimes uh, it took me days, weeks on the painting, you know, try to bring out um, the perfection. So I decided to spend my day, my time on it. So I don't have anything else I'm doing than this. So I have to give my full support. I have to give my full time, sacrifice everything. Just to make the best piece. Well, that's that. It takes time, but as long as you're happy with the final, you know, with the process and the final product, that's what matters. And also the, the buyer, you know, or whoever uh, give you the commission for that uh, art work. Oh, thank you very much. And what would you recommend younger generations uh, so they get interested in, in art? Because, you know, sometimes that helps uh, fulfill the mind and uh, develop more creativity. Um, you see, art is like a, um, it's like a, it's another way of putting a diary. So like, like I said, it's like another way of putting a diary, and the world is, uh, can't do without art. So art has been a system for so many years. Right. Like you have modern art, you also have contemporary art. So, the journey of art started millions of years ago, uh, if I can say, and, and, I, and I, as I can see, art, is, art has, really taken, it has really taken over the world. Okay, so you, you, were, you were telling um, about the, you know, the process with younger generations, about the, the you know, how they will get more interested in, in art, so they, they become more um, they develop more creativity. No, um, like I said, art has been, art, art has, has been resistant for so many years. 
like millions of years ago. So, and we have modern artists, we also have contemporary artists. So, if till now and the next coming generation, art has been one of the largest thing that is going around the world. So, my advice for the young women artists is to make sure they keep doing what they love and they give their full support to the career and they should make sure they, uh, they make they make beautiful art piece. So uh, people will have interest in yeah, that's, that's, very good. Good. <laughs> that's very nice words and it's very important you know for the family as well to support uh, a new artist because that that love will represent uh, into a more passional uh, work. Um, Alabi, and have you ever been on 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 on, on shows or uh, on a gallery? How has been that experience uh, exposing some of your paintings? Yes, um, I've been to shows. Maybe I think twice. Twice I can see. I still look out to attend more 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 more, more shows. See, um, I have some of my paintings in the gallery, like I said earlier. Like, two of my paintings in the gallery. And, yeah, it has been something, it has been really nice. Meeting up with new artists, a kind of privilege. And, and I, I wish to see more, 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 more kind of privilege, to meet up with international artists. So, that's That, that's 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 true you know also from galleries it's also a big support for for newer artists so they can express and show their artwork i have seen in in like in the united states and some um, countries in latin america that they um, usually they do some uh, small trade shows or art shows where they give opportunities to newer uh, artists so they can show their skills and how wonderful their art is because that's that's also very important and 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 in, in, in you, where you are located does the government or local uh, entities uh, support artists like yourself in in that aspect mm -hmm. um actually um the way my country is going so um uh, i don't see the support that much but only few support arts i don't really see the support mm. in nigeria and an artist has to strive and work hard you know work hard for so many years before before he or she could, 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 could get, gain on the on the audience you know it's, it's, it has not been easy for an artist you know working all day all night and at the end of the day people try to look down on his art So I've witnessed cases like that. That's how it's been. So and I've seen a lot of artists from Nigeria going outside the outside country to the United States, Italy, for exhibitions for big shows. And they are really, really making us proud there because they are giving they are, they are giving them full support outside the country than here in the country. Well, that's 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 you know that, that's a big call for the government. So they they, they support. But also, you know, like this space where you have the opportunity to show your artwork and, and, and become more um, exposed, have more exposure to the international community as well. Okay, so you're going to show some of your artwork because I know that there is some uh, pieces in the back, but uh, I don't know if you want to, to share the, what's on, on each uh, piece of art that you have in there. So I only have to hear. I have to hear my aspect here. Okay. Um, okay. There is one here. And um, I have one here. Okay. That's a portrait. That's yourself? Yeah. Okay, for my. <laughs> I was actually working on a new piece. And the kind of new media. Uh, so I just started from weeks ago. Uh, I was in the band. And this also, I have one of the Okay. 
Yeah, that's um, that's one of the the ones that I saw that you you put a lot of uh, emphasis on 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 the eyes and the expression of the person, which is very sometimes very difficult to 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 uh, put on 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 canvas or on on paper. Yes, I also I like I asked some of my friends to be there, so I said this to my other on my house. I will tell you to you. All right. Oh, yeah. So, so yes, I so I can I can put it at the end of the video, so so the people can uh, see some of the artwork that you have done and how skillful you are. Okay. And how um, can people get in contact with you, Alavi? What is the best way for them to to get in touch with you? Maybe they want to, so that they can, uh, you know, ask you, hey, how much for this painting? And you know that that way they can connect and follow you on uh, on social media as well. So um, the can out to me on my Instagram. Uh, my Instagram account. My LinkedIn account, my Facebook account, yes, I use Facebook also, and I'm on TikTok as well. Um, I will say, I will drop you the link. So maybe you can just put this on the timeline. All right. So I, I will put the information as well at the end of the video, so the, the people can get it. Uh, you know, go, go uh, below and click on the links, so they will redirect it right away to your social media and start in contact with you that's why i was asking if you want to leave a, a final message but you know please everybody follow alavi on social media uh check out the fantastic work and you know follow or uh, uh, follow us on our channel as well so you will uh, find new episodes and new artists uh, that will have an you know a, a way to express themselves on this channel. All right, uh, thank you very much. Uh, shout out to people on this channel. Um, I love you, I love you guys. And actually, I have to say, actually, this is my first time being on, a, on, a, on an interview. So, and I think I will see more of this. Definitely, it will, it will. It will be, yeah. be, it will be like that. Definitely, definitely, definitely. This, this is my first time. All right. So yeah. thank you so much, Alavi, for being in this space. And as a reminder to everybody, please follow uh, Alavi's social media and get in touch with him. So you are able to buy and have some exclusive and unique artwork from him. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.